In this video, I will show you how to work the open work crochet pattern, which we use in our Phoebe Poncho. Today, I will be using our five millimeter rosewood crochet hook and a ball of our shiny happy cotton yarn in nude pink. Let's get started. Begin by making a foundation chain, which is a multiple of five stitches plus two. So here I have made a chain of 17 stitches. Now to begin working the open work crochet pattern, you'll need to first do a setup row. So begin by chaining a further three stitches. One, two, three. Beginning with the fourth stitch from the hook, work a double crochet stitch into the next two stitches. So yarn around your hook and go into the fourth stitch. So one, two, three, four. And work a double crochet stitch. And then repeat again to work a second double crochet stitch into the next stitch along. So once you've worked your two double crochet stitches, make two chain stitches. Skip the next two stitches of your foundation chain and then work three double crochet stitches into the next three stitches. So skip one, two, and then work a double crochet stitch and then work two more so that you've got a group of three double crochet stitches. And keep repeating that sequence until you come to the end of your row. So chain two, skip two, and then work three double crochet stitches. So chain one, two, skip two, and then work three double crochet stitches. So this is what your piece should look like once you've completed your setup row for the open work crochet pattern. And you can see that you have groups of three double crochet stitches divided by a chain space, which consists of two chain stitches. Once you've worked the setup row for your open work crochet pattern, um, the stitch is made up of two pattern rows. And so to begin row one, make five chain stitches. One, two, three, four, five. Three of these are your turning chain and then the other two will form the chain space. Next, work three double crochet stitches into the next chain space, which is here. Like so. Now chain two, one, two, 
and then repeat that sequence right across your row. So working three double crochet stitches into the chain space and then chaining two stitches. So three double crochet stitches in here. One. Two. Three. Then chain one, two, and then work three double crochet stitches. One, two, three, chain one, two, and now that you've reached the end of your row where you've just got your two double crochet stitches and the turning chain from the previous row work a double crochet stitch into the top of your turning chain it can be a bit fiddly So this is what your piece should look like once you've worked your first pattern row.